Okay, so today we're going to be talking about things that are typically British. So, Monica, what do you think is typically British? Ah, oh, right. Um, well, I think the first thing that comes to mind is food. Of course. Yeah. So, is it true that fish and chips is the most typical British food? Actually, uh, a lot of people do think that fish and chips is the most co common and most popular British food eaten by all British people all the time, every day. Yeah, I think the, that's what people think, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. The reality mm -hmm. is, the fact of the matter is that we uh, also love curry. Yeah. And curry is the number one most eaten food here in Britain. Hmm, you see, I think that might sound surprising at first, but then when you think about it, it's not really, is it? Curry is so popular. It is. It's, yeah. it's a staple of the British diet now. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so do you like curry? Yeah, I'm a big fan of curry, mm -hmm. although nothing too hot. Um, I'm, I prefer mild curry, right. personally. Right. Anything mm -hmm. that uh, makes smoke come out of your nose. No. <laughs> is that a bit too much, yeah? <laughs> a, bit, a, bit too, a bit too much for me. Um, yeah. So I, I like a typical... Um, anglicised curry, mm -hmm. like a, a chicken tikka masala or a korma, right. something like that. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Alright, so what about other things? What, what else uh, do you think would be described as typically British? Um, I think the usual things, you know, that students always think about, of people who um, come to Britain for the first time, the red buses, yeah, and red phone boxes. Ah, uh, yes. Uh, that's quite typically British, isn't it? Yes, particularly if you spend any yeah. time in London, you're bound to see yeah. a red bus travelling past or or a phone box, although less so now, what with uh, mobile phones. Yeah, that's true, that's true. And the buses are changing as well. I was really disappointed that there aren't that many red buses anymore in London. It's just a lot of different companies now with their own buses. Yeah, that's Not the same shame. anymore. Yeah, it's a shame. Yeah. yeah. For me, um, if someone says the British, talking about the people, mm -hmm. the first thing that comes to mind is politeness. Yeah, I would agree with that. Yeah. Many people mm -hmm. say, oh, the British, they're, they're very polite, even too polite sometimes. Always saying please and thank you and mm -hmm. sorry, even if it's not our fault. I agree with this, yes. That's my experience as well. <laughs> okay. But that's nice, I think. I think that's you? a positive yeah, character trait? A, yeah, definitely. Very positive. Okay. Better that than grumpy and... Rude. Exactly. And I think it would be excused in a way because when there isn't that much sun, people are not that happy, are they? Yeah. Ah, so the weather. The weather, yeah. You, you've hit the nail on the head there. Yeah. <laughs> the weather is very uh, typically British, isn't it, when we talk about lack of sun and way too much rain. Yeah. But do you yeah. think that's a true stereotype? Um, I don't know. Um, when I lived in the north of Spain, I was really surprised because I thought it was a lot wetter than the UK, in winter anyway. Okay. It rained and rained and rained constantly. So I don't think it's a true stereotype, really. I, there must be places in the world that get more rain than the UK. Uh -huh. But perhaps they get warm rain, whereas here we get... That might be it, yeah. The bitter cold yeah. rain in January. Which and is... wind and... Yeah. Whatever else, yeah. Hail. <laughs> That's right, yeah. yeah. Snow sometimes. Yeah. Okay, so we've talked about food, we've talked about our character traits and the weather, of course. Mm -hmm. um, anything else that springs to mind when you think of what's typically British? Um, driving on the left-hand um, side, yeah, uh -huh, that's, yeah yes. that's what people think. We like mm -hmm. to do things a bit differently, yeah. here, don't we? Yeah. The majority of other countries drive on the right. Um, I guess the same with money as well, mm. the British pound. Yeah. You don't want to let go of it, do you? <laughs> it's, uh, yes, close to our hearts, shall yeah. we say. I'm not surprised <laughs> at okay. all. Great. All right, so there we go. A few things that are typically British. Mm -hmm. Thanks for answering my questions. You're welcome. For more speaking video lessons, exam preparation courses, and one-to-one -one Skype lessons, please visit britishenglishonline.com.